What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescagebreaks.com. 2022 Panini Flawless Collegiate Football just sold out. This is a one-box break. Pikachu's number three. And here we go. Remember, no group break checklist yet. So we're going to go by the team they played for the longest if active. Or team they are currently on if active. And then we go by the team they played for the longest if they are not active, retired, or out of the league. So here's everybody that bought in straight up with a couple of the RMB teams there. And then here are the customers in the RMB. Boom, boom. So, we're going to cut this open. Boom, boom. And again, we have two cases here, guys. Back to where this should be. And again, Top or bottom, let's see which one we generate here. One, two, three for the top, four, five, six for the bottom. Dice roll, roll it. And it is a six. We've been going with bottom first lately today. One, two, three, four, five, six. So this one here at the top is gonna be for number four. And this one here will be for this bird. All right, here we go, guys. First one is a Isaiah Spiller, two out of five. Nice jumbo pass there for AM. And Isaiah, I think was what we were just talking about him earlier, right? That's a Charger, right? Yes. So Chargers, that is going to uh, young. All right, we have Traylon Burks patch. It's five out of 25. That's going to go to the Tennessee Titans. Matt Smith. And one of one. Was he not supposed to sign it right here? Or is that Triven? Oh, no, I guess it was right now. Oh, anyway. Uh, <laughs> Gino. For the U. That's a nice one on one. I don't know. What team or how many teams you played for? A little bit of oh, a little bit before my time. But let's go to Pro Football Reference. And hmm. This one's going to be tricky, actually. 
I mean, I don't know if anybody should be fighting for this card. I guess maybe for collegiate purposes, but <laughs> let me show you this. Let me, see, let me figure this out. But uh, Minnesota, age 23, one game, no game started, no completions, no nothing. So he probably dressed for a game, but didn't play at all, even though he's part of the team. But Seattle did dress for one game, but actually played, it looks like. Had five completions for 16 attempts, 41 yards, one TD, one interception. So... I would assume after years, it was games, tiebreaker, right? And he actually played, because I think we've done that before. Whereas if the years were the same, then we go by games played. So technically, I would have to probably give this to Seattle, because he actually played for them. <laughs> but what an interesting player here. Did he just not translate in the NFL? I I'm not too sure, to be honest. Yeah, he was a seventh round pick. Looks like he was on a lot of different teams though, but just never played, I guess. Wait, what? Did he play for all these different teams? Oh, I guess he went to NFL Europe for a while. Well, we usually go by Pro Football Reference, and I mean, yeah, I would, I would give it to Seattle. I mean, that's usually what we usually do after games or years. We go to games, and it seems like at least he played one game. I don't know if anybody would be complaining about this. So Seattle, that's RMB one. Steve Locke, there you go. But I don't I hope we don't get too many of these guys. <laughs> Alright, let's continue on. Cameron Thomas. At uh I forgot where, where I looked at Cameron Thomas. I looked him up earlier. Where was his rookie again here? Where where's he at again? Arizona Cardinals, there it is. Yeah, I mean, that's how usually we do it, and I just, this one's very tricky. <laughs> Alright, so. Let's see. I don't think anybody would be debating that, though. Alright, we got another Isaiah Spiller. This time, a nice little patch auto. First one was just a patch. That's another one there for the Chargers. Chargers. That is going to Hyung again. I have to think that the encased cards are going to be pretty big. I don't know. Like so far, this has been a little underwhelming, right? Heinz Ward. Pittsburgh Steelers, of course. 2 out of 25. Steelers, that's going to Ed. Aw. My right, last one here, we have Jamison Williams, a little diamond and autograph that is going to the Detroit Lions and Matt Smith. next one out here guys here we go we have a Roger Staubach 14 out of 20 that is of course Dallas
Devontae Adams, 4 out of 20. That's Raiders. Raiders Jerry. Or, yeah. All right, here we go. This should be the patch auto. Brees Hall. Man, this second half got to be monstrous, right? Brees Hall, RPA, 9 out of 20. And that is going to the New York Jets, Steve Locke. Man, getting the Jets hits, though, in case... I'd love to see the second half of this case, honestly. All right, and there you go, guys. That was the break. Uh, that was number three. Number four will be in an RMB right now soon. We could break that next if you guys want. Uh, nine teams left. I'll give it a few minutes while I'm putting this stuff away, uploading videos, printing out labels. Um, see if anybody wants to buy any teams. But there's a lot of teams in the 30s, 40s, and then just the Patriots are the only team at 100 uh, with the Seahawks at 80. So. I'd love to run this back one more time, guys. I feel like there could be a really big hit for one of these teams in the next half. So let's get it going, jazbeescasebreaks.com.